when God is not speaking it's because he has already authorized voices over your life to speak if I see Apostle Joshua Selman's text message now it doesn't matter what he said there for me I know I've entered a new season celebrate men in the kingdom based on their sacrifice and if you don't know what they do with God just honor them because the person will not come and tell you what they did because he that seeth in secret reward in open Psalms 50 verse 5 to 6 verse 14 to 15 read that at home and then lastly learn to activate the prophetic learn to activate the prophetic Hosea chapter 12 verse 13 says by a prophet he brought them out and by a prophet they were preserved sometimes God will not speak because he has already spoken how? he has appointed a mouthpiece when it is time to access a new season and all the other protocols are not working for you locate your prophet who is your prophet? the human representation of God's voice to your life sometimes they change with seasons sometimes they are constant don't allow your prophet to become your mate don't allow your prophet not to be able to correct you when you are wrong you'll be killing yourself so some people get so spiritual that they now have grown above their prophet so they don't communicate with them again they don't talk to them again they don't tell them anything about their life listen let me tell you that's a booby trap satan is a very wise man he knows how to manipulate you by using you there are men i would never be familiar with because i know what they can do if i see apostle joshua selman's text message now it doesn't matter what he said there for me i know i've entered a new season even if he said from grace to grace that's what you will say but the difference is he says his own with weight i hear what i'm saying so anything i must do to activate it i will do if i call him he no pick no problem i don't expect him to pick if i text him he no reply no problem i go send seed one day go see the seed vex text me and that's the end the Shunammite woman saw Elisha. Oga come the chop. Elisha didn't ask her for food. Though. Oga, anytime you pass, come eat. Then later on, they built a room for him. Say, now we know that you are always, you need to rest. And you are a man of God, you need quiet place. So there's a room upstairs for you. And there's table there, you can be writing all the revelation God is giving you. Elisha say, ask this woman what she wants. When God is not speaking, it's because he has already authorized voices over your life to speak. There are some times where it is the voice of a man that will bring you out of one season to the other. When Joshua the high priest was standing before the angel and Satan was resisting him, the angel rebuked Satan and said, The Lord rebuke you. This is a branch plucked from fire. He had just gone through a season of suffering and trial. And because of that, he had been purged. Now let's decorate him for the next level. Then the prophet who was watching in the vision said, let them put a crown on his head. And the crown was put on his head. Without that turban, the symbol of his authority in that new level would not have been signified in the realm of the spirit. He was a prophet. Meanwhile, in Israel, that high priest was greater than Zechariah. That's why native doctors stay in ramshackled houses in the bush. But they are the reason why some people are in government of, of positions.